Hey everyone, my name's Amanda. I'm kind of new here. I have my, it's Sunday, my husband's downstairs and watching his political shows. I'm sitting here in a shirt that my mom got me as a gag gift, but it still makes me laugh. It's perfect for wearing underneath the sweatshirt, doing whatever, hanging around the house. And if you're not ashamed, you know, going in public. So currently I have um, been trying on different stuff from my subscriptions this month. And yesterday, while we were at a birthday car a birthday party for my friend's one-year-old, uh, who I will lovingly, lovingly call Baby J, uh, he was, uh, we, I got my Ipsy bag in the mail. I haven't really pulled anything out, but hey, we'll try it on. So what I've already done is I uh, put on my foundation. I have been using the eyeshadow from uh, the Dolce palette that I got in my FabFitFun. I have been using this palette or this colors, the warm, neutral colors because it's Sunday. I'm just playing around. Um, I have also put on some blush from the Be, Be Fearless Be Limitless palette right here. I uh, am using the Unstoppable, which is the brownish color. Uh, I have been using my crown blush. Um, quick. It is one that you could build up. Some people may think, oh, I need all the pigment, but you know what? Uh, I don't. <laughs> I like the idea of building up. I love things like tart blushes and whatnot, but um, they can be a bit easy to get too much product. Next, I'm gonna go in with the bronzer uh, that I got from Beauty Basics. Um, I'm going to take my Moto brush uh, in BMX 130. This is the one I use a lot of the times for bronzer because it's big, it's fluffy. And I'm gonna use my handy dandy hand mirror because I can't see. So, oh my, it's quite a soft palette. Um, I have a thingy on my table, so I'm just actually, for my next one, going in. I do have a little bit of a matte bronzer because this is quite a shimmery bronzer on my face. So far, I'm liking this uh, eyeshadow from the Dulce, 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 D-O-U-C-E. C-C-E, D-O-U-C-C-E um, palette. And the, so, so far so good. It does have some shimmer in it, but uh, it is not the most pigmented either, which I like because with uh, bronzer, you don't want to go in, you, you want it to be very sorry my camera just made a noise you want it to be something that you could put all over your face uh and so i have that all on i have my eyebrows done everything else next is the ipsy bag yay i'm not going to use my tarte mascara because well i have like four open so this is the bag is it pretty yeah Oh good, we're still recording. I just had a check, because yeah. All right, and uh, evidently we got a little highlight brush. Ooh, it is so pretty. Oh my God. Um, I'm thinking this might be from the Lisa Frank collection. I could be wrong. I, it doesn't matter to me, it's just pretty. I have um, hair oil from Way. I have an eyeliner in the color fishnet from Smashbox. And I have a feeling that's, I think fishnet is black and I have several, so we're not gonna use that today either. Actually, I'm not gonna use eyeliner today. But I do have the melted latex lip. It's a high shine liquid lip and I don't remember the color. Hot mess, it's a bright pink color. I'll go ahead and swatch it on my hand. Oh my, look at that. It's gonna have to go on the lips. 
it's going to have to. I may not be doing anything exciting today, but hey, I will have fun lips. Sorry, um, let me get a Kleenex here. I have some chapstick on. Let me dab some of that off. It goes on like a gloss. That's pretty neat. Um, hopefully it's not as drying as a liquid lip. Actually, so far, it's not dry yet, but I really like the feel of this. Um, yeah. Now, this here reminds me of Kathleen Lights. Last month when she opened her Ipsy box, uh, she opened a Lisa Frank. I think it was a bronzer uh, from Glamour Dolls. It's a collab between the two. And... Here's what it looks like, the, the packaging. I think the, the packaging totally reminds me of when I was a kid and with Trapper Keepers and, and pencils and folders and erasers and all that stuff. It was great. So this is actually, I believe it's an eyeshadow in the color Stargazing. Well guys, I haven't put on a highlight yet. I'm, so I'm gonna use it as a highlight using my handy dandy highlight brush. And, uh, excuse me. And, uh, I'm trying to be respectful of my husband and his, uh, TV watching stuff. So I'm sorry I'm not loud. I'm not super caffeinated. Probably a good thing because, you know. Okay, this is super great as an eyeline, as a highlight. Do you see this? And I love this little brush. It's perfect. Okay, maybe I'll dab a little into the center of my lid. Maybe I'll do a little bit more. Okay. All right, good to do. Yay, done. Well, um, I think that's everything except for that hair oil, which I don't need at the moment. No, I don't need any in my hair at the moment and neither do my reindeer. I don't know if you could see him on my head. <laughs> so anyway, I have all of my BoxyCharm, Ipsy, um, and the uh, fat fit fun stuff tried on that I'm going to try on uh, and I already do have a mascara open so I'm going to just go in with that I actually have two because I like to layer okay this is the one I can find easily because I have to put things away guys I am just a slob so that's what we're going to do is go in with my Lash Paradise that's already open The good news is if Boxy continues to do this mascara and Ipsy does it, I will never need to buy mascara again, which may be a very good thing because I tend to fall for hype. In fact, this week I am doing a um, series called Hyped Up Holidays. Uh, so that way we could say, hey, Amanda fell for the hype. <laughs> so this is the final look and here we are. You guys have a great afternoon and uh, happy Sunday. Bye-bye.